before we get started again. If you haven't done so already, please do take a moment to silence your phones. And also just a quick reminder that following the ceremony, we will be having a reception for all of our guests where we'd love to spend some time with you and get to know you after the ceremony. All right, let's get this started. Honored guests, please stand and join me in welcoming into the auditorium Southern New Hampshire University's College of Online and Continuing Education, Executive Directors, Associate Deans, and Faculty. Welcome the folks that we are all here for. I'm pleased to introduce into the auditorium Southern New Hampshire University's 2018 College of Online and Continuing Education Academic Award recipients.
Good evening, everyone. And on behalf of our Vice President of Academic Affairs, Dr. Greg Fowler, and all our SNHU academic family, I want to welcome you all to our 2018 SNHU College of Online and Continuing Education Academic Awards Ceremony for Liberal Arts, Social Sciences, and Education. I'm honored to be in this room with each and every one of you tonight, the students, family members, and friends present. My name is Dr. Ruth Lottie, and I'm the Senior Executive Director of Liberal Arts and Social Sciences here at SNHU. And I will be your Master of Ceremonies tonight. Tonight, looking out at each of our graduates, my heart is full of joy as we honor your incredible achievements, achievements you have fought for through a long journey toward your degree. This weekend is all about celebrating you and those individuals who have supported you through this journey, many of whom are with, here with you tonight. Our SNHU family is thrilled to join you in this celebration. Here on the platform to help honor you tonight are the leaders of the various COCE academic departments, whom I ask to rise as they are introduced. Dr. Jennifer Batchelor, Associate Vice President of Academic Programs. Dr. Gwen Britton, Senior Executive Director, Science, Technology, Engineering, and Mathematics Programs. Dr. Jan Wyatt, Senior Executive Director, Business, Nursing, and Health Professions, Mental Health Counseling, and Education Programs. Anthony Siciliano, Executive Director of General Education and Interdisciplinary Studies. Dr. Mark Wilson, Executive Director, Mental Health Counseling Programs. Dr. Michelle Hill, Executive Director, Social Sciences Programs. Dr. Denise Basalian, Executive Director, Health Professions Programs. Dr. Peggy Moriarty Litz, Chief Nursing Officer. And in the front row of the auditorium are the associate deans and faculty of the various programs here at COCE. <laughs> this entire weekend is about celebrating achievement. The students present here tonight, along with all of their fellow students who will attend commencement tomorrow, and all the students who are unable to attend commencement in person, will know the joy of celebrating the achievement of earning their university degrees. And we, their families, friends, loved ones, teachers and administrators, delight in the opportunity to salute them and celebrate with them. And while this weekend is definitely about them and their stories of success, it is in no small way a celebration as well. All of you who have come here tonight to support students and to see them receive this honor are part of their success story. Because of the support and love that you have given them during their journey, we salute and honor you as well. In our commercials for SNHU, we say that the process of achieving your degree has the ability to transform lives. We don't only mean that this experience will help you on your journey to a better career. Through your hard work and dedication, you model for your family and friends, and especially children in your world, what it means to persevere through challenges. And speaking of challenges, I just realized I forgot to ask you all to sit down. <laughs> Please be seated. I was wondering what that signal was in the back saying, go like this. Well, now you all got your extra steps and exercise in for the night. 
thank you for bearing with me. <laughs> Through your hard work and dedication, you model for your family and friends, and especially children in your world, what it means to persevere through challenges, prioritize multiple responsibilities like work, family, and school, and what success looks like. We, the members of the SNHU family, take great pride in your achievements, and we are honored that we play a part in your success. Now to the reason that we're here tonight to honor our students. Beyond just graduating this weekend, the students in this room hold an additional distinction. Not only did they achieve their dream of earning a university degree, they did it while achieving the highest GPAs in their respective programs. Each of these individuals, and there may be more than one per program, are among that elite group to be called the best of the best in academic performance. We celebrate all our student graduates this weekend, but tonight we pay special honor to those of you who through your dedication and hard work have earned this added distinction. We know that tomorrow will be the big day for you as you receive your degree, but we also want this to be a big evening for you as you receive this recognition of your outstanding academic performance. And so as each of you comes forward this evening to receive your certificate, I ask you to remember that no matter where you go, no matter what you achieve, and no matter what else happens to you in your life, no one can ever take away the honors you receive this weekend. They are yours for life. At this point, I'd like to invite Dr. Michelle Hill to come to the podium to introduce our distinguished students from social sciences. Good evening. I'd first like to introduce Associate Dean of Faculty, Dr. Nick Dominello, to join me on stage to help hand out the awards. And I would also like to invite the rest of our associate dean team, Dr. Jeff Zarnick, Dr. Barb Lesniak, and Deb McNutta to join us off stage for our receiving line to greet our award winners. And now I would like to invite all of the students in the social sciences programs to please rise and line up to the right of the stage. When your name is called, please come up to receive your award and make your way back down to your seat. Our first award winner is Ashley Aubin. <laughs> Lindsay Gale Burns. <laughs> Ashley Amber Casey.
Patricia Cisneros. Wanda R. Cross. Lisa Derepenjni. <laughs> Sorry about that, Lisa. <laughs> <laughs> Sarah Beth Glazer. Courtney Fiddler. Janielle Gordon. Rebecca Hope Hall. <laughs> Stephanie Hurst. <laughs> Christine Cole. <laughs> Kristen Grace Lindemann. Patrick Marr. Michelle Renee McCorkle Whitaker. <laughs> Melissa McFadden. Thomas J. McGrath. <laughs> Rebecca Lee Ordnoff. <laughs> Tara L. Pytruszynski. <laughs> Kimberly Ann Raffaelli. Kara M. Rodriguez. Angela Marie Solomon. Rebecca Diane Snyder. Carolina Vega Suarez. Amber Lee Summers. Tara Whiting. Carolyn Whitaker. David Wiesner. Jennifer Yeaton Paris. Allison Sharkey. Stephanie McGrath. And we're out of envelopes. <laughs> Come on up. What's your name? Laura Bello. Laura Bello. And I'd like to ask everyone to give all our award winners for social sciences another round of applause. Congratulations. Thanks, Michelle. 
At this point, I would like to welcome all of the deans from the liberal arts area to join us on this side of the stage, and for Dean Derek Craigie to join me on stage. Will all the students in the liberal arts programs please rise and line up in alphabetical order at this side of the stage. Our first award winner, Ashley Malak Amiri. Deirdre Ann Ash. Suzanne Lynn Araldi. Francis Henry Boudouin. Laura Michelle Bello. Oh, I think that was our social science student. There we go. Thank you. We found it. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Sarah Alice Putz. Jeremiah Brown. Matan Brown. Okay. Aaron Chartier. Jennifer Elizabeth. Chase. Jewel Clyde. Robert D'Angelo. William J. Doyle. Mindy May Farmer. <laughs> Bethany Guthrie. <laughs> Nicole Decker. Erica Carolina Fernandez. Tracy Lynn Geary. Joanna Gibson. Joshua Brian Giger. <laughs> Valerie Grayson. <laughs> Joanne G. Hoffmeister. Charles Johnson. <laughs> Kaylee Jones. <laughs> Dan.
David Peter Iverson. Anne Marie Keeney. Caitlin Kelly. Jenna C. Kepik. Emma Bronwyn Lang. Danielle Lawson. Nicole Marie Ladapoulos. Kai Lee. Jennifer L. Scott Madison. Devin Moore. Nancy E. McKenzie. Rebecca Catherine Mitchell. Matthew Joshua Morgan. Tracy Lee Music. Amy M. Nawarta. Kaloni Pearson. Samantha Prost. Samantha Jane Raymond. Amy Reniker. Grant Roberson. Michelle Tapper Racine. Lynn M. Reichenthal. Victoria L. Schwartz. Heather Fawn Shaw. Jeremy David Singer. <laughs> Melissa Christian.
Christine Soto. Susan Elizabeth Speckman. Carol Stenson. Stacy Sweeney. Christina Toman. Pamela Ann Walden. Bethany Webb. Stephen Michael Weir. Holly Michelle Weir. George Daniel Mateo. Mamet Ayaz. Amber Shea Maine. And last but not least, Abigail Nerano. <laughs> Please join me in congratulating all of our liberal arts winners. At this point, I would like to introduce Dr. Jan Wyatt. Good afternoon. May I ask Dr. Daniel Tangway, Associate Dean of Programs and the Faculty for Education Programs, to please join me on the stage. Take your time. Uh, may I ask the award recipients from the education program to please join me to the left of this, left right of the stage. So last but not least, um, so here's the thing about going last. I have a little bit of power, right? Because <laughs> here's the thing. 
I know that you know that there's food over there. <laughs> and I'm what's standing between you and that food. So I can pretty much get you to do anything that I want at this point. <laughs> so I have a couple of requests. Uh, can I have the associate deans uh, and the faculty please stand? And can you please hold your applause till the end? <laughs> um, these are the people, these are my colleagues, who um, you may not recognize the faces, you might recognize the names, um, but these are the folks who over the last few years of your journey have been there supporting you, fighting for you, sometimes fighting with you to get you to the point where you are right now standing in front of your families and friends graduating. So please, one more time. Thank you. Okay, one more request. To our education students, take a minute to see if you can find in the crowd your, your loved ones, your families, and your friends, and give them a round of applause. They have also been there supporting you all along the way, every step, being your greatest advocates. Thank you. And that, that was touching, that was nice. Um, but from this point forward, the rest of the next few days is about you. The next few days is about your hard work, your sacrifice, the great choices that you have made uh, when your friends were out partying, you were at home studying. When you, your kids were screaming and fighting, you were letting them scream and fight, and you were, you were doing your exams. You put in the time, you put in the effort, and the next days is our congratulations to you. You deserve it. Congratulations. As I call your name, please, please come forward. Christina Casella. Donna Dukeshire. Elizabeth Marie Fortier. Joseph Gunnison. <laughs> Iva Freeman Freemanis. <laughs> Linnea Eileen Hilchi. Christopher Scott Johnson. Karen Jordan. Mary Cryer. Jennifer Wallensack Lucier. Todd Martin Medovich. Ashley Ray Parkhurst. Jody L. Peters. <laughs> Daniel Poulin. <laughs> Thank you. 
Emily Marie Robinson. Christine Sargent. Crystal Lynn Sexton. Rachel Barbara Shaughnessy. Lisa Schumann. Joanne Stotler. Okay. Barbara Zabriski Tomaskiewski. <laughs> Almost made it through. <laughs> Congratulations. What is it? Tomaszewski. Tomaszewski, thank you. <laughs> Stacy Welsh Andrade. Precious Avant Green. Nope. Elizabeth M. Blow. Blow. <laughs> Fanny William Phillip. Barbara Green. All right. Uh, one final round of applause for our education program graduates. Honored guests. That brings us to the end of our ceremonies tonight. If there are any students who are present whose names we didn't call because they may have checked in after the ceremony started, please raise your hand. Anybody? We want to make sure that we honor each and every. Oh, please come up. I saw that tiny little hand. Come on up. Come on up. She gets the long applause here while we come up. Oh no, come up, I want to read your name. We're not letting anyone leave here tonight without reading their names. <laughs> and you get, to, you get to shake everybody's hand. <laughs> Abigail Naranjo, everybody. One more, all right. Come on down. Come on guys, we can keep the energy up here. Ladies and gentlemen, Michelle Nelson. Anyone else? Going once, going twice? I'm looking for timid hands there in the audience. It looks like we've got everyone. All right, well, I will ask that you remain seated until the platform party and students have recessed out of the auditorium. Again, on behalf of SNHU, 
I congratulate each and every one of you on this amazing distinction and on your graduation. We look forward to seeing all of you tomorrow at your commencement ceremonies and good luck as you move forward into the world to continue your journey of personal discovery and success. We invite you all to join us now for light refreshments. And as you take your leave, please travel safely. Thanks, everybody.